Well, we know the city of Detroit is getting hit hard by the coronavirus, but now we're getting a closer look at the neighborhoods hit hardest. Take a look at this heat map from the city health department. It shows a major cluster of uh, cases in the northern portion of the west side of the city. Our Larry Sproul spent time in those neighborhoods today to find out what's going on. And Larry, there's, I guess, really no straight answer. There's really no answers at all, Kimberly. We don't know why this is happening or how this is happening, but we do know that the city of Detroit is being hit really hard when it comes to the amount of coronavirus cases. As a matter of fact, two neighborhoods are hit the hardest. Let's break down the numbers. So many of our loved ones, family and friends are being affected by this. It's something Melanie Williams Bowers knows personally. On any given day, Melanie is ripping and running from meeting to meeting, planning various events. She owns her own business, Guru Public Relations. But recently, her busy schedule came to a complete stop. Just two weeks ago, her father died from the coronavirus. It happened so fast and so suddenly. My dad passed within hours. There are no words to describe what's happening in our city. Um, like you said, it's happening right in our own backyard. And unfortunately, Detroit has the numbers to prove it. I obtained the latest numbers of COVID-19 cases. As of Wednesday, Detroit has 7,020 cases with 424 deaths in the city alone. The top three age groups of cases, about 20% ages 60 to 69. The age group of 50 to 59 makes up almost 19%, and 40 to 49 years old comes in with a little over 16%. Now, when it comes to COVID-19 deaths here in Detroit, African Americans make up 75.7% of total deaths. Now, this map shows most of these deaths are in District 1. That area is in and around West 7 Mile. In District 2, that's the Fitzgerald neighborhood. And we also know the amount of cases bro broken down when it comes to gender. Now, about 55% of the cases here in Detroit are female, 44% are males. We're live in downtown Detroit tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4.